Yeah, definitely not as strong or as fast, right? Um, for the fire rate, so you can back off. Yeah, a little disappointing. Hey guys, and welcome back to Terra Tech with me, Tenzin. How are you doing today? I'm doing pretty good. I hope you're doing pretty good. If you guys like today's episode, please like and share as you see fit. If you haven't already, please subscribe. Wow. <laughs> Mouthful. Um, but I did build a new tech for us today. Not the greatest. I was hoping that we had more better future blocks than what we do. We have to make do with what we have at the moment, because in the last episode I said we were going to start making hovercrafts because we maxed out uh, Hawkeye, and now we need to go after the better future parts. So, this is the best I could come up with at the moment. It doesn't look right. It's not nice. But it just means there's more reason for us to go and... How far is this away? 6.7 kilometers. Wow. Uh, go and get um, more blocks, right? Look at that. Shield bubble. Or the shield bubble and repair bubble are both exposed. Mm -hmm. That's the type of uh, build we got going on here. But we do have a super powerful build. <laughs> so I did put the, the yeah sonic sonic blasters, one on top, one on bottom. I did want to go with two on the bottom, but uh, they take up a lot of room. As you guys can see, the white box around them. What are they? One, two, four, five, six. A six by six. That's pretty far. Or a lot of room. And then I was thinking, oh, well, I can just put them on the sides and put them sideways. But then I was trying to figure out how to do the hover pads. You know what? Just how it ended up is how it ended up. <laughs> Alright, uh, there is something I'm forgetting to do here, so, air brakes, even though it doesn't really seem like we're having issue with braking, you never know when it could happen, so, do we put an anti-grab tip engine on here? Not that big, but if we put it right in the center, there we go, kind of like that, yeah, alright, I I think we're kind of good to go. Probably get some thrusters on here too. So it's kind of annoying. <laughs> the text if you uh, push two buttons at one time, like backwards and left. It kind of does the exact opposite. It will start to go backwards, but then it won't It won't do the secondary action of turning left. It'll actually go right, it seems like. All right, so we're doing this one. Quest is way over there. I also think that I want to adjust. So interesting how quickly everything changes. You build something and you're like, oh no, this I missed this. But alright, 6.7 kilometers. I'll see you guys over at Hubble. Well, that was a journey. Oh, one second. We got a guy coming in. Oh. Interesting. Found it interesting how uh, he was able to dodge my attacks there. He was moving faster than the bullets, or what do you want to say, the plasma was flying? Either way. Alright, so we're going to go into a race here, so let's, like this, change the power to half. Um, let's get rid of the weapons. I'm not saying that's a good idea, but... Might help us out a little bit. Actually, you can probably... I like those weapons, I really do. Um, but I think we can swap out for different, different style. Weapon. It is kind of more lethal, but... Uh, those aren't the good ones, though. So, complete the time, time trial. So, let's do this. Oh, come on. Hmm. 
This is what's hard with this one. Because you have to use the up and down arrows plus W A or W S A D. And you gotta try and kind of use your mouse if you can. Like it's so much easier to go or to drive when it goes where I want it to go. <laughs> Don't you dare. No. Oh, oh, come on. This isn't even a time trial either. I'm not 100% sure why the butt of my uh, vehicle keeps kind of just going where it wants. Either way, we'll figure it out eventually. Gotta get used to everything again. <clears throat> yep. Good thing this isn't a time trial, too. Can you tell I'm trying to concentrate here? That was horrible. But we got there. Which means new parts. Oops. Back up a little bit. Oh, what did we get here? Deliver cannon and the refinery. Darn, I was, I was hoping that was the, the fabricator. No dice, though. No dice. I think this is a new shield generator, isn't it? Yes, it is. Sweet, we got one of the new shields. Uh, all right, let's go like this. We obviously, have this Hawkeye guy over here. Let's see what we can do. If we can't murder him. Nope. Ooh. Um. <laughs> Yeah, I think we just got out of there just in time. All right, morning is here, and I did make the adjustments for our uh, our blasters. So hopefully, yeah, we won't get have them destroyed, and yeah, we'll be protected, maybe. All right, let's go deal with this Hawkeye guy. Well, that wasn't bad. All right, so any stations right over here. More Hawkeye right off the bat, eh? Oh, this is the guy that we actually started the battle and then took off, right? You know what I mean? The Hawkeye blocks can take these, take a hit from these, uh, these guns, but uh, it's nice because they don't destroy too many blocks, right? Kind of like the railguns, but um, I'm going to say not as powerful, or they're more precise, one of the two, right? But I guess powerful and precise is a weird way of putting it. Yeah, I'm going to say the railguns are definitely more powerful. Rate of fire is definitely higher with these, right? So, catch 22. Wet work. Uh... Anti-gravity. Uh, come on. Whatever. Alright. Uh, let's go to this guy. Sergeant Smash. Okay. Oh, for some reason I thought we were already looking over that way. Um, actually, while we're here, let's see what we can purchase. Yes. Darn. I did not want one of those. <laughs> one of the tires. Okay, what else did we want there? Weapons, yada yada yada. Uh, shield bubbles, I mean, uh, yeah, the, sh the edge shield. Not yet, not yet. We can probably, we'll probably get a lot of them anyways. 
Um, yeah. I like those ones. They make my life easier because they come with the... Uh, uh, the adjustment thrusters built into them. I think that's it. For the moment. Okay. Need to be facing the right way this time. Backing up is... Hmm... There we go. We're off to the races now. And... Stop. Needs to turn this up just a little bit. There we go. All right. That was weird. Oh, there we go. That's why. Take the turret out. Okay. We don't need to save it this time. Wow. Like one minute you're like, hey, this is like super strong. Next minute you're like, uh, is that the best you got? We're still shooting at this guy. Okay, watch. Yeah, watch me. Will you stop it? Really, really bother. There. That's what we'll do. <laughs> Many rockets to the rescue. Another, oh. yeah. So I was hoping for that. That way we, we didn't have to deploy ours. I didn't have to go into my inventory. I'm lazy, okay? Alright, so... Anti-gravity race is 3.5. Hover training immediate. Uh, I bet you they're in two opposite directions. No, oh, it seems to be in the same one. So I guess might as well go to intermediate first. And then we'll go to anti-gravity race. Alright, here we are again. At least this one's not time. Okay, let's turn this down. Oh, too much. There we go. Oof. Uh, yeah, you can die. Alright, fine. Is this time? No. Ugh. And I wasn't paying attention right off the bat again. Come on. I don't know what's going on with... Like the loss of control. I know there's a dip here and everything like that, but... It's quite interesting how... I don't know. Maybe I'm just complaining to complain. I'm trying to throw you off this scent. Me being a bad driver. Either way, we got her down. Alright. That's a booster. Maybe that'll help regain some of our control. Not 100% sure. Alright, what do we got? Uh, anti anti-gravity racetrack. That one's going to be difficult for me, in this at least. I love that I show up, because that this, the track started right here, and, and then all of a sudden all the trees just get destroyed, and then this pops up. 
I don't even know if uh, we can get up high enough to go through that. Oh, okay, he's got a, a bot for us to purchase. Why not? Yes, please. Take a snapshot of this. Bad. Cover. There we go. And we got that. Now we can jump over here. And we can get rid of that. Where's front? Okay. Forward is that way. This one is super quick for turning. Kind of like the small or the tiny uh, venture hover uh, plane that they give you, right? Maneuvers really, really well. Make a look a little beyond well, right? Like <laughs> maneuvers so well, it's like, yeah, I don't think I would need to be able to turn that that quickly ever. Okay. Better take a picture of this guy, too. Yep. Save that. Overwrite. Clearly, we already had him. Fabricator? Yes. Alright. Now we're now we're making some moves. What's that? That is, uh... Oh, the trapdoor laser. Okay. I was looking at it the opposite way. Come on. Hmm. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Do we want to just stay in this tech? Yeah, I don't mind this one, but or we can make a wheeled one. Eh. No. No. Okay. I will head over to the next training station and see what we can get, and uh, we'll go from there. Even more. Black Op White Wind now. Uh, that one. And another Ant Gravity. Ooh. This one first. I don't remember White Wind. To secure this area, we need to have a touch on the birds, yada yada yada. Morale by taking out as many. Sorry, HQ estimates. Oh. Is this the last one of that one? Give them no quarter, trooper. Okay. What I do want to do, though, that those oh, I'll probably go like this. That that there we go. Now I'm feeling a little bit better, weapons-wise at least. need more and more blocks you guys at least now that we have the fabricator we can start fabricating a lot of the better future stuff yeah okay we're doing this sorry might as well get rid of these guys first spool up let's go And it seems like on the side here, they're not uh, targeting as well as they normally do when they are when they can shoot straight forwards and just have to look up or down. Either way. Sorry. Are they in the same area? Nope. Alright, let's go to this one. More hovercraft training. Uh, yeah. I guess I'll see you guys over there. Oh, be nice if they change just a little bit. Like, even just the guy. Hubble, just different color every time he showed up. Just be kind of nice. You know what I mean? 
it would just Ooh. maybe Hubble has uh, you know co-workers or brothers and sisters or whatever you want to say <laughs> oh come on that's not fair All right, uh, nothing too snazzy on that go. But I tried these propeller or the, what do they call these ones? The rotors. <clears throat> Sorry, I gotta use the rotors on this this season. Don't think I've really experimented all that much with them uh, since they've been introduced into the game. Yeah, definitely not as strong, or as fast, right? Um, for the fire rate, so you can back off. Yeah, a little disappointing. Maybe if we went... No, because I'll have to clear those. Yeah. I'm just going to put the rockets on the side, and then the guns top and bottom again. It won't fit. Got an invader. Well, back up. Anchor in. Spool up just as soon as he's about to come in. To our world here. Let's do it. Oh, this one again. The resource. I think we destroyed one of the resources last time. Did we do it this time too? Oh. Oh. No, uh, I don't think so. I think it's two, two bundles. Uh, or is it three? Ah, we'll go with two. Either way, two is still good at 240 of those. Yes, please. Here we go again. Um. Oh, but I don't have any charge. Bullet panel. Battery. Oh. Charge. There we go. Go while the, the going's good, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this one's a time trial? Come on. Oh. Can't tell. Come on. Need one block on the front to be a different color. And... Why can't we swap? Good stuff there. We got a what is this? The uh, anti gravity field, gas. Eh, what's this one? All oh, the flamethrower. Not a hundred percent sure why they keep putting flamethrowers in the game. Like I know there's only two of them, but um, yeah, I do like aesthetically they look cool, but to actually use them in battle, I've never used them. How about yourself? Have you used the flamethrowers in battle? Have you ever thought, hey, I'm gonna get that close to somebody? 
See if I can burn him alive. All right, well. Guess we're heading to another trading station. So this was the only, um, or a better future quest I could find. I think we're actually going to walk ourselves out here. Do you want to purchase do an improved hoverbird for the price of what? 75? 57. Do we have it? I can't afford it. So we'll just actually we'll try this vehicle and see what happens. We've increased the number of track turns on the track by a hundred percent, huh? Focus. How many turns was that? Two? Or was it three? Either way. <laughs> Alright. Good stuff. Uh, oh, we got one of the new cabs. Not bad. Uh, I should really start putting these la this landing gear on our text too. We'll uh, fight this guy in a second here. I actually really like the the hive missiles. Messy, but uh, yeah, they the rapid fireness of it all, and that overall, it, with it that unit being able to uh, rotate, plus the the missiles are kind of like homing, small homing missiles, making my life really really easy. If you guys like the episode? Please leave a like, leave a comment, and if you haven't already, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Honey, I'm a perfect and